ethnic countries in America that are participating today. And now we have our first competitor, Carla Diaz from Mexico. Some of the other Mexicans are a little bit more expressive in their routine, but she's very technically strong. Those great dynamic elements and catch at the end there. And a strong finish. next gymnast who will be competing is Patricia and she is our Canadian golden girl. She swept the Commonwealth Games uh, with the team gold. She was also first in the all-around competition as well as in hoop, ball and club. Patricia's coach is Svetlana Jukova and uh, she was actually my first coach in rhythmic <laughs> gymnastics. So I was also coached by her. <laughs> I think everyone was, but yeah. she's such a great coach and it's so great to see her having so much success. Second finalist, Segunda finalista du Canada, from Canada, de Canada, Patricia Bezubienko. She's obviously a crowd favorite here in Toronto. <laughs> Patricia probably has some of the most difficult routines in the whole competition because she trains uh, um, in Russia a lot of the time, but she's jam-packed with difficulty.
great. Great performance for Patricia. She'll be happy with that. Patricia Bezubienko. Unfortunately, she had quite a few mistakes for the all-around competition and finished um, fourth overall, but she'll be really happy with that performance, I'm sure. And look at this pirouette she does. I think she does about five or six. <laughs> and the way she stops, the control that that takes. Very together impressive. at the end. That was a very clean performance. Prochaine finaliste, la siguiente finaliste do Brasil, do Brasil, from Brazil, Natalia Gaudio. Up next, we have um, Natalia Gaudio. She actually finished sixth all around here at the Pan Am Championships. step out of bounds to grab your equipment. But she recovered fast. Covered quite well after that mistake. Natalia Gaudio, Brazil. Mm. Gymnasts have 10 points for execution. So any mistakes with the apparatus or with their body difficulties would be part of that score. Brazil has a very strong presence in group, which we'll see later. They actually won gold in the all around here at the Pan Am Championships. Up next, we have Jasmine Kerber, also known as Jazzy Kerber. She, she won gold in the all-around in the, in the Pan Am Championships yesterday. She's really well-known for her pirouettes, and she's extremely clean. I've known Gabby since she was up to my knees, so it's really great to see her doing so well. Jazzy's coach was telling me she's so blessed to have her. She's just Prochaine a finalist, next finalist. So polite and never finalist. complains, works so hard. Des états unis from United States of America, the Estados Unidos, Jasmine Kerber.
strong performance for Jazzy. I think she had a few nerves in that routine, but as you can see, her pirouettes are just sensational. The control she has with her legs mm -hmm. and the spin and turn is perfect. With this new code of points, the pirouettes are awarded really high marks. I, I believe she gets about 1.2 for her pirouettes and points, so it's definitely a strong point. Up next, we have Annabelle Kovach from Vancouver, and she was also part of the Team Gold for the 2014 Commonwealth Games. Second ranked in Canada right now. Prochaine finaliste, next finalist, la seconde finaliste du Canada, from Canada, Annabelle Kovacs. Annabelle is coached by Kamina Petkova in Vancouver at Orrithic. finish. Annabelle Kovacs, Canada. Very nice routine by Annabelle. We would like to ask for a cooperation. Please, no flash photography. Thank you. No, to this our flash, por favor. Here we can see one of her pirouettes. She's in good control there. She'll have a very strong, um, you know, execution artistry score because she was very clean and she was with the music. It was a very good choreography. Up next, we have Rebecca Sarita. She actually is, um, she plays second at the U.S. Championships and she plays second here behind Jazzy Kerber as well. And Russian uh, competitors. Rebecca's next known finalist, the um, siguiente finalista de Estados Unidos, de um, Estados Unidos d'Amérique, from United States, sure. Rebecca Cerreda. I've heard many people call her the Kanaiva of USA, who's obviously the Olympic champion. Two time Olympic champion. Oh, <laughs> thanks for the correction, Susie. <laughs> Dum 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 
Beck is known for her jumps and her artistry. That's one of my favorite moves in her routine. Good recovery. At least she finished on time with the music, even with that mistake. Her coach, Natasha, has produced a lot of really successful rhythmic gymnasts in the past. Here's that catch you, you liked. <laughs> Next finalist, the Argentina from Argentina, Milagros Carrasco Piñi. Anna from Argentina. Anna finished eighth in the all around yesterday. Very good routine. I think she's going very, very fast for the music, but with this code of points, you have to. <laughs> it's nice to see Argentina being so successful, as I think we competed with Anahi Sosa, and they, she's the one that kind of brought Argentina on the map internationally, right? Next is Angelica from Brazil, and she finished fourth, third. She finished third yesterday in the all-around competition. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was very close between her and Patricia from Canada. Dernière finaliste, la ultima finalista du Brésil, do Brasil. Angelica Ficinski. She has the nicest feet, I think, out of the whole competition. <laughs> Very 
well. She threw very far behind her. Unfortunately, she'll have a slight 0 0.05 deduction finishing after the music, but that toss was definitely worth it. <laughs> Timed warm up for ball. Calentamiento cronometrado por pelota. Now, ahorita. Ruth Castillo, Rebecca Serada, Jasmine Kerber, Patricia Bezubienko. Two minutes, two minutes. 